It was certainly a tragedy in the skies over central Phoenix, and it happened 12 years ago today. Two TV news helicopters collided in midair over Steel Indian School Park while covering a story. The crash killed four people. ABC 15 pilot Craig Smith and photographer Rick Krolak, as well as three TVs pilot Scott Bowerbank and photographer Jim Cox. Team 12's Trisha Hendricks takes us back to that day that changed TV news forever. Bad. This is very bad up here, Scott. On July 27th, 2007 at 12.46 p.m., three TV and ABC 15's choppers were hovering over the area near Central and Indian School Road when they collided while covering a police pursuit. A tragic situation that started as a ball of fire and then <laughs> confusion and reaction from people on the ground. I can't believe they went down, they hit, yeah. they hit. I saw it, I heard it. I'm emotional, I feel like crying, I've already cried. That time I was live reporting. 12 News photographer Daniel Clark was in Sky 12 above the scene watching all of this unfold through the lens of his camera. And I thought I heard somebody scream. Turn back around and get away from this. We do have two helicopters down during this trash. We're not sure which helicopters they were. All eyes then moving to the crash instead of the suspect. I went from the chase, immediately broke off that, zoomed in and saw the wreckage. When the helicopters oh, fell from bad. the sky, four bad. members of the media we lost their that. lives. I hear my pilot start going through crash. roll call of who was up in the air and then we found out. Clark knew all four. ABC 15's pilot Craig Smith and photographer Rick Krolak and 3TV's pilot Scott Bowerbank and photographer Jim Cox. We all flew out of the same complex. Following the coverage, it physically took a toll on Clark to the point he had to seek counseling. Still bothers me. He will never forget the words of a 3TV reporter when it happened. We lost uh, true legends. And... That's what they were. I mean, they were legends in town. Since this tragic accident, the news industry has changed. We went to a shared helicopter, and from then on, the person who is reporting is the person designated as a reporter, not as a pilot. A change Clark sees as a change for the better. The safety factor is that those are lives up there. And not only are there lives up there, there's lives on the ground. And fortunately, had a tragic accident like that, it happened in the one place where nobody was really at at the time. And the family of 3TV photographer Jim Cox created the James Allen Cox Foundation for student photographers in order to celebrate their lives.